Precession is an important metric in the world of machine learning for classification problems. How do you calculate it? It is simply the proportion of correctly identified positive cases out of all the positive cases that the model has predicted as positive. Let's consider an example of a model that classifies whether an email is spam or not. Suppose the model has classified 100 emails as spam and 80 of them are actually spam which means these are true positives and 20 of them were misclassified which means these are false positives. In this scenario, the precession of the model is going to be 0.8 indicating that the model was correctly able to identify 80% of the spam emails. How do you interpret precession? In general, a higher precession value is desirable because it indicates that the model has low false positive rate and it is accurately identifying the positive classes. When do you use precession? Precession is a useful metric to use when the focus is on minimizing false positives in a binary classification problem. To know more, stay tuned.